Hi there, this is Sunil from Product Management at Tintree. Today, let's take a closer look at VM scale-out recommendations and how you can customize them. As a quick recap, when you add VM stores to a VM scale-out pool, the algorithm starts to model the future in order to predict resource issues. And if it foresees any of those, it'll show you a recommendation like this. First, it articulates the issues. Then it lists the actions that needs to be taken. And finally, what the outcomes would be if you were to execute this recommendation. Let's see how you can fine tune this recommendation to your needs. The first thing you can input is which issues to focus on. You can see here that the issues are grouped under their respective VM stores. If the model had predicted that a VM store would run into multiple issues, like say, out of space and heavy load, it would list all of them under that specific VM store. In this environment, there are two VM stores and they're each experiencing heavy load on a regular basis. Let's assume that you don't want to make any changes to your all flash VM store because you're actually running some performance benchmarking test there. To indicate that intent, all you need to do is uncheck the appropriate issue box. VM scaleout will revalidate the remaining issues and produce the list of VMs that needs to be migrated in order to resolve them. And that is what you see here. At any given point in time, you can use the start over button to reset any changes that you might have made in the current session. What it does is it takes the recommendation back to its initial state. The next thing you can fine tune is the set of VMs that are going to be migrated. You can review the list of VMs and if you, for whatever reason, don't want to migrate a particular VM, you can provide that input as well. You can mark a VM as don't migrate for now, which means that VM scaleout will skip this VM in its current cycle. Or you can say don't migrate to a specific destination VM store, or you can say never migrated from its current location. Let's say I choose don't migrate for now. When you save the setting, VM scaleout will recalculate an alternate solution for you. We call that a backup recommendation. If there are sufficient number of VMs, VM scaleout can provide up to four backup recommendations for each issue identified. This provides you maximum flexibility in terms of your resolution options. You can also set these migration rules up front and you can choose that by selecting a VM and selecting the appropriate migration rule. VM scaleout will remember these inputs and will adapt its recommendation to your needs. Back in the recommendations, all along the fine tuning process, the outcomes pane was updated in real time. You can review it one final time before you execute this recommendation. So there you go. It's that simple to fine tune recommendations with VM scaleout. For more on this topic, please check out our other videos. And thanks for watching.